We are taming the main people today. Hello, welcome back to another video. Hope everybody's well. I didn't think that I would be back so soon with another food race video. A little bit of a backstory, just in case you are clicking onto my videos for the first time. I like to check out different places for food waste. I usually do it through the Too Good To Go app. However, last week, one of you guys told me about Dalesford Organic doing a zero waste food box. I went, I ordered one, I checked it out, I shared it online. The other evening, I thought, I wonder if there are any other places that do similar waste boxes. And I found one from a company called Fennel and Ginger. Never heard of Fennel and Ginger. The food waste box was £15 with a £3.95 delivery charge. Guaranteed to come within about four to five days. You could pay 5 95 get next day delivery, something like that, by up to for 3 95 as I was in no hurry. And it came today, two days delivery, that quick. I'll show you how it comes and then we'll have a look to see what we've been given. I'll work out the value uh, of what it would have cost if we were paying full price and uh, I'll pop that on at the end. One of the things that it says on the internet is that each item is going to have at least 10 days on its best before or use by date. And if you sat wondering why I'm doing it, why I'm buying a box blind, because I have no idea what's going to be in it, I just like finding different things. I just like trying different things. And this is one of the ways that you can potentially do it cheaper. And it's a little bit of fun. The first thing that we've got is a real organic food company, Rogan Josh cooking sauce. And the use by day is the 14th of April. So that's interesting because I've opened it on the 13th. So that's not 10 days, is it? How that, I mean, not that I'm not gonna use it, but I swear that that is what they said. I'm gonna go back and recheck. But it's within date, but I'm sure they said 10 days. I'm gonna have to go and have a look. Anyway, got a nice Rogan Josh sauce, and it's, Rogan Josh is not what I usually cook with. I'm normally like a chicken tikka sort of person. I'll either make my own, or by a Lloyd Grossman, so that'll be interesting to try. Vegan stuffed red peppers. Let's have a look for the date on this. So that's best before the end of April 2024. Perfect for antipasti platter. Sweet red peppers with flavoured, uh, with vegan stuffing, so that'll be interesting to try. Packet of wholemeal pasta. And what the date, so that's 16th of April, so again, I'm going to have to check to see. It says, uh, these are the same delicious products that we sell on our website and all products in our Love Food Hate Waste boxes will leave us with at least 14 days until best before day. Our Love Food Hate Waste £15 box will contain products with an overall retail value of at least £38. We have a Love Cocoa. Again, this is April. Uh, gingerbread, 71% dark chocolate. That looks nice. It's got like little pieces in it. Can you see? That's 75 gram bar. Popcorn shed, red velvet. Red cocoa caramel popcorn with white chocolate. 24 gram bag. Then we've got something else from popcorn shed. Toffee mini popcorn. Vegan, gluten-free, whole grain, all natural, non-GMO, made in the UK. <laughs> no floss required. Ooh, a spiced rum flavoured dark hot chocolate spoon. I love, it. I love finding different companies. So far, I've not, other than the pasta, I've not heard of any of the companies, which I'm liking this. Cottage Delight, I have heard of Cottage Delight. If you haven't heard of Cottage Delight, they do the most fantastic chutneys they, and farmhouse pickles. It's a really good company. Again, you find them in farm stores, but you can order directly with them. And this is Thai Jasmine Coconut Rice, and it's the dry stuff, which is good because I don't have a microwave. Um, that would be nice to use, I'm sure. Sticks, thick potato fries, crisped chicken. Crisp roast chicken potato crisps. They are the 16th, so there's nothing past its date, which is good. What have we got? Cooks and Co. Banana Blossom. Cooks and Co. You can get this through um, Cardo. I've never, never had Banana Blossom in my hand. If you have cooked with Banana Blossom before, please let me know what you've done with that. 
I will Google it as well. And then I've got a couple more. Do goodly dips. Mighty beetroot barina. Is that how I say it? A Persian inspired classic with vibrant beetroot and the fresh freshness of mint. Naturally stacked with nutrients, a superfood source of the fibre. So is it some kind of like a hummus thing but made with cannellini beans? Oh my god, no. Love more. Love more free from fruit foods. Gluten free, wheat free, milk free. That's fine, but the first ingredient is margarine. I'm going to put them in our local food waste place. Oh, I reckon I know this brand. Oat milk bar, that's the 30th of April. Plant based, creamy oat milk, plastic free, salted caramel, little bar. And that, my friends, is it. So, what do you think of that? It's, it reminded me of a um, Degusta box. So, total value amount was just over 38 quid if you paid full price for everything. There were a couple of items um, that were on sale in places and quite a few of the bits uh, were available in Ocado. But as I've said, Ocado stock some bougie stuff. <laughs> um, I think it's different. I know I said that it's like a degusta box. But now I've had a good look through the things and this is it. When you're filming, you're reacting there and then. And then, you, you know, once you're finished, you go away. You eat some of the chocolate um, and you have a good look and you have a good think. So I think it is like a degusta box, but it's a little bit of an upmarket degusta box <laughs> where if you ordered one, you might get different to me. Credit where credit's due, they gave a really good variety of things. You could have a film night with all the snacks. You've got meal, you know, things that you can cook for meals. I don't think that I would order it again, but that's just because there's other places that you can get snacks from, not because I don't think it's good value. I think if you like the more bougie stuff, you like me, you like a little bit of a surprise box because you're a bit bland and you've not got out else going on in your life, then maybe you should try it out. Right, I am going. Thank you for being here. Take care and I'll see you again next time. Bye.